almost all of us like to play game right they may be 3d game or 2d game or 8-bit games sometimes we also use our phone to play game and sometimes a game console a very low prices game console is this sub game console it is available with over 400 games and there are many more future inside it to analyze it carefully i opened this sub game console to see what was really in it and then i saw that it had an audio amplifier to loud the speaker and there was also a memory IC, another one is microcontroller and that is completely pasted with this PCB which is no way to change and it seemed hard enough to me. But now the main question is, is it possible to create an alternative to this game console in a very simple way? Yup, it is possible. Although not exactly the same but still it is possible to create some options. Ok guys, let's find out how to create it. This video is sponsored by GLC PCB. It is better to say here, GLC PCB is a really beautiful PCB making board app company where always you will get excellent benefit when you order your PCB. So I will definitely order my today's project PCB. As a result, I can create a professional game console. GLC PCB always take care of customer like you can live chat anytime for any inconvenience. Even you can choose any PCB color for free of cost. There are also many benefits such as SMT service, stencil, PCB panel, gold plate, so on. To take advantage of all those opportunity, today upload your graph file by visiting the GLC PCB website for few dollars. Ok guys, this is my game console circuit that you will get in the description box. First I need to create a very nice 3D printed box for this game console. And of course I have to keep in my mind that the PCB has come to me. How big is it and what is its volume and its accurate measurement. So with all that in my mind I take accurate measurement from around this PCB. And then I start making a 3D printed box on my favorite Fusion 360 software. And it looks little bit like this after it is done. And this is the 3D printed part which took me about 5 hours to create. Ok, next let's mount all the component in this PCB. As the brain of this game console, I will use here a tiny 85 ic which is very easy to solder. Even here you can use DIC if you want. Here I will use a 12 mm push button switch to operate this game console, which I will definitely mount on this board to control different options. As a power source, I will using here 3 volt CR2030 3 volt battery. That's enough for me to run this game console. And also I must not forget to mount these switches for on of this game console. And you can see here all components are mounted correctly on our PCB. Now is the time to install LCD in this PCB. I will using here a 128 into 64 resolution OLED display which is enough to give the correct resolution to this 8-bit game console. And after then I will insert this 3 volt battery into this battery socket of this game console. Now it's time to fit this circuit into my 3D printed box. Then I will put all the switches cap on this switch and after then I will close the lid on the top cover. Even definitely I not forget to fasten the LCD panel guard as well as. Look, it does not look too bad, right? Now is the time to program this game console. So with that in my mind, I will use my homemade programmer to program this 8985 IC. You can easily program by connecting these ISP pins. And you can see guys our first ping pong game has been launched. And that's pretty fun, right? This game remember of some childhood memories. You will also be able to play more amazing game on this game console for which you will have to insert other games. In today's video, I hope you have a little fun. If you like this video, please like it and don't forget to subscribe my channel. See you again in the next video. Stay well and stay healthy.